Welcome, everyone. Today, we're not just celebrating a milestone. We're celebrating you and the incredible journey we've shared in the DGpedia Cybersecurity Insights series. As we wrap up our Letter A series, let's take a moment to reflect on our achievements. Over the past few months, we've released 20 amazing videos packed with knowledge, insights, and skills to elevate your cybersecurity expertise. Now, let's dive into the highlights. Here's a quick look at all 20 videos that have shaped our journey together. Each one a stepping stone. Each one a vital part of our mission. What is access control? Access control is the process of determining who is allowed to access specific resources within a system. It establishes rules and mechanisms to protect sensitive data and ensure that only authorized users can view or manipulate information. What exactly is adversary emulation? In simple terms, it's the simulation of real-world adversaries' tactics, techniques, and procedures, or TTPS, to test and evaluate an organization's security posture. By mimicking potential attackers in a controlled environment, organizations can identify vulnerabilities, improve their detection capabilities, and enhance their incident response strategies. What is AI-powered security? AI-powered security refers to the use of artificial intelligence technologies to enhance and automate security processes, including threat detection, incident response, and predictive analytics to safeguard systems and data from cyber threats. By leveraging advanced machine learning algorithms, AI can analyze vast amounts of data in real time, identify patterns, detect anomalies, predict potential vulnerabilities, and automate responses revolutionizing the way we protect our digital environments. What is anomaly detection? Anomaly detection is a powerful technique used to identify unusual patterns or outliers in datasets. Imagine a tool that can spot the unexpected, alerting us to potential issues before they escalate. As a crucial component of cybersecurity and data analysis, anomaly detection enables organizations to identify patterns that deviate from the norm ensuring proactive measures against threats. What is application security? Application security refers to the measures taken to enhance the security of applications throughout their life cycle. This includes identifying, fixing, and preventing vulnerabilities that could be exploited by attackers. By implementing secure coding practices, conducting regular security testing, and establishing robust security controls, Organizations aim to protect applications from unauthorized access, data breaches, and other malicious threats. What is advanced threat protection? Advanced threat protection refers to a comprehensive suite of security solutions designed to detect, prevent, and respond to sophisticated cyber threats that go beyond traditional measures. These solutions leverage cutting-edge technologies, such as machine learning, behavioral analysis, and real-time threat intelligence to identify and mitigate risks associated with advanced persistent threats, zero-day exploits, and a variety of malicious activities. Asymmetric encryption. What is asymmetric encryption? Asymmetric encryption, also known as public key cryptography, is a method that uses a pair of keys, a public key and a private key. The public key is shared openly, allowing anyone to use it to encrypt a message. In contrast, the private key is kept confidential by the recipient and is used to decrypt messages that were encrypted with the corresponding public key. This two-key system significantly enhances security, enabling secure communication without the need to share a private key, Attack Surface Management, or ASM. So, what exactly is Attack Surface Management? Attack Surface Management is a proactive cybersecurity practice focused on identifying monitoring, and managing potential vulnerabilities within an organization's digital environment. The attack surface refers to the total sum of all points in a system, such as applications, services, and network interfaces, that can be accessed or exploited by a cyber attacker. The goal of ASM is straightforward, to reduce this surface by continuously assessing risks and implementing security measures to protect valuable assets. Application Programming Interface, or 
API security. APIs are the backbone of modern applications, enabling different software systems to communicate seamlessly. However, with this connectivity comes risk. So, what exactly is API security? API security refers to the practices and technologies used to protect APIs from malicious attacks, unauthorized access, and misuse. It includes various measures such as authentication, authorization, encryption, and the use of API gateways. Automated Threat Intelligence So, what is Automated Threat Intelligence? Automated Threat Intelligence refers to the use of technology and machine learning algorithms to automatically collect, analyze, and disseminate threat data without requiring constant human oversight. This advanced approach enables organizations to swiftly identify potential security threats, vulnerabilities, and malicious activities by aggregating information from a multitude of sources, such as threat intelligence feeds, security logs, social media, and dark web forums. By harnessing automated threat intelligence, organizations can proactively detect threats, respond to incidents in real time, and enhance their overall cybersecurity posture. Let's start with a detailed definition. An attack vector is a specific path or method that cyber criminals exploit to gain unauthorized access to a computer system, network, or application. It's how attackers deliver malicious payloads and execute their schemes. Ad hoc security. What is it and how does it impact our digital safety? Let's find out. Ad hoc security refers to temporary security measures that are put in place to address specific threats or vulnerabilities. Unlike formalized security policies, these solutions are often reactive, designed to tackle immediate concerns without a comprehensive framework. Attribute-Based Access Control, or ABAC. So, what exactly is ABAC? Attribute-Based Access Control is a dynamic access control model that allows organizations to grant or restrict access to resources based on a set of attributes. These attributes can relate to the user, the resource itself, and even the environment at the time of access. Let's break it down further. User attributes could include the user's role, such as a doctor, nurse, or administrator, a specific department they belong to, and their clearance level for accessing information. Resource attributes pertain to the type of resource, like whether it's a patient health record or an administrative document as well as the level of sensitivity of that resource. And finally, environmental attributes might consider factors such as the time of day or the location from which the user is accessing the system. Active defense. So, what exactly is active defense? Active defense refers to a proactive cybersecurity strategy that not only works to prevent unauthorized access and attacks, but also engages with threats in real time. Unlike traditional methods that mainly rely on firewalls and antivirus software, active defense employs advanced techniques like deception, threat intelligence, and automated incident response to combat cyber threats. The goal is to create a dynamic security posture that adapts to evolving threats, ensuring that organizations can effectively mitigate risks and minimize damage. Account Takeover First, let's define what account takeover or ATO, really means. An account takeover occurs when an unauthorized individual gains control over a user's online account without consent. They achieve this through various illicit methods, including phishing, credential stuffing, and exploiting weak passwords. Once they have access, attackers can view sensitive information, make unauthorized transactions, and cause significant harm to their victims. Automated Incident Response as cyber threats evolve, so must our defenses. Let's explore what automated incident response means, real-world scenarios, and valuable lessons we can learn to enhance our security posture. First, let's define automated incident response. This refers to the use of technology, including predefined rules and machine learning algorithms, to automatically detect, analyze, and respond to security incidents. The goal is to minimize the time it takes to react to threats, thereby reducing potential damage. Anonymization. Anonymization is the process of removing personally identifiable information from data sets 
so that individuals cannot be easily identified. This technique is essential in sectors like healthcare, finance, and research, enabling organizations to utilize data while safeguarding individual privacy. Application whitelisting. Application whitelisting is a security measure that allows only approved applications to run on a system or network. Unlike blacklisting, which blocks known malicious software, whitelisting permits only those applications that have been explicitly verified and authorized. This approach significantly reduces the risk of malware infections and unauthorized access, as only trusted software can execute. Arbitrary code execution. Arbitrary code execution refers to a security vulnerability that allows an attacker to execute any code of their choosing on a target system or application. This can happen due to flaws in software, such as buffer overflows or improper input validation. Once an attacker gains this ability, they can manipulate systems in various harmful ways, from installing malware to stealing sensitive data. Audit trails. An audit trail is a chronological record that traces the sequence of activities and changes made within a system, application, or database. It captures critical information about who accessed the system, what actions were taken, and when they occurred. This meticulous tracking is vital for ensuring accountability, compliance, and security, providing a means to review actions for audits, troubleshooting, and forensic investigations. From understanding access control to unraveling audit trail, We've tackled crucial topics that empower you to navigate the digital landscape with confidence. And as we celebrate this achievement, we're also looking ahead. Get ready, because we're about to embark on our next adventure, Letter B. In the upcoming series, we'll explore new frontiers, diving into breaches, botnets, blockchain security, and much more. The excitement is just beginning, and we can't wait to share these insights with you. Thank you for being an essential part of this journey in the DGpedia Cybersecurity Insights series. Here's to our achievements with Letter A and to the thrilling adventures awaiting us in Letter B. Let's keep the momentum going. Until next time, stay curious and keep pushing boundaries.